the Rams down by nine into the forecourt. Weber, hop step into Johnson. Johnson shoots and misses, rebound, and Weber's down and he is hurt. Ramp or maybe he is in a lot of pain. Either way, he's in a lot of pain. I've seen DeAndre and somebody else is right in the middle, like at the top of the key. And I tried to split him over the top. So when I like kind of brung the ball over the top of DeAndre, uh, DeAndre's head, and when I planted, it, it was like, I don't know, felt like I got hit with a bat. Again, you can't diagnose that. So he's not coming back in. We know that for sure. Now right. your hope is that for the, it's just a sprain knee. It's two different feelings. Like one, they say you don't feel anything. And then the other one, it's like a car crash. I was the car crash victim. I watched it one time, and that was after I had my x-ray and, um, and MCV. That's a, I watched it one time, and I, I deleted it from my phone. I would say about an hour, I was kind of depressed. Then I don't know what happened with, with it. Like, I kind of I kind of snapped out of it. I was like, this is still a season. Like, we have a whole season like a whole half of the season left champions of the atlantic 10 conference when i went out january 31st they they got all came together said we were gonna cut down the net you know who's gonna be the last one holding that they told me it was gonna be me and i believed in them that's all it took for them to do it and now we're here today and i'm and i was the one to cut down the net which very made me very emotional take it back I'm not going to be uninjured so so I was like I mean I can make every day the best day and to get better to get myself back on track to be where I wanted to be it kind of it made me hungry in a sense and it made me stronger minded in, in a lot of things most difficult part is just thinking about where you were before the injury and where you got to get to so like single leg anything is, is so it's tough it's just like you just feel like you got to you have to start all over again from from scratch, like building back up to the person you were. And that's that's probably the, the toughest part because you know what you're capable of and then you know you don't want to be anything shy of that. Well, yeah, you see my left leg shaking just as much as my right. Uh, you, you just, some days you're just like, I'm not feeling it, like, but <laughs> sometimes you just got to get past that. Me, I'm very, I was, I was a very impatient person, like, I, <laughs> I want it to happen now. Like, I don't want to wait. Like, five minutes could kill me. I can see why patience is what it is because some things you don't want so quick, kind of like with, with just like how, how life is. You don't want anything that's easy, you don't want it. Something you have to work for and build up to is something that you're, you're, you'll love for the, long, for the long haul. The NBA aspirations is definitely a tough part, but just being, all, you was almost in the door and then like putting the, the pause button on it is, it's tough, but at the same time, that's where your patience come in. Like, I, I waited um, 22 years. I mean, what's what's a couple more months? You know, I mean, it just shows how much how much harder I have to work to get to where I want to get to. I mean, work never hurt nobody. Once I finally got off the table and started moving, and like getting on the bike, rehab became better and better. And now it's like actually agility and like jumping and and moving is way better because it's getting more basketball focused. Right. Tomorrow? Yeah. yeah, good. Okay. I need it. <sighs> Every new thing that I can do is exciting. Like I wanna keep doing it and get better at it. Like I wanna be a perfectionist at it. I wanna I wanna make sure that I'm probably one of the best to do it. First time getting back into a game, like an actual game, it might be like overwhelming, it might I don't know, it might be like a Toledo game again. <laughs> I might just be all over the place. Yeah, I think about it every I think I have I have dreams about that. Like just to just, just start the new beginning. I would tell them if they're nervous about my knee, just give me one shot and I'll make sure that you wouldn't be nervous about my knee because you're because once I step between the lines, no no worries come from me. I'm I'm a player, I'm gonna give it my all.